Welcome to Take Care guys this is Saurav here and today I am back with another ROM installation tutorial and in this video I will be installing the AOSP ROM and I will show you that how can you install the AOSP ROM on your Redmi 3S or the 3S Prime. I am currently using the Resurrection Remix ROM version 5.7.0 that runs on Marshmallow 6.0.1 the installation video link will be in the description make sure you check that so don't waste don't, i would just don't want to waste your time go to the reboot go to the recovery and just click on ok and make sure that you have a you know custom recovery installed like twrp or cwm but i recommend you go for the twrp that has more options and it's pretty good you know well we are here in twrp the first thing is to wiping few things like dalvik uh, slash art cache system data cache and these four and you are good to go so wipe them and it's almost done but for you it might take a lot of time but it's take a little bit of time don't worry now the time has come to install few zips the first zip is the AOSP L A N D O T A English then there is kind of Chinese thing that I don't understand well swipe to flash then it's gonna take a bit of your time so I'm fast forwarding it for your you know it's definitely gonna take uh, you know 5 to 8 minutes of yours or more than that less than that more or less 5 to 8 minutes and you just have to you know be patient at that time so yes it's done and now that I must come to swipe the you know the install the G apps so you can wipe Dalvi cache again after that and now the, come, the time has come for installing the open G apps uh, let me tell you that use the 64 one use the ARM 64 one do not go for the only ARM version and guys when I flashed the open G apps uh, uh, for the very first time and I, I switched on the phone and there were some issues with the G apps but then I again flashed it I again flashed the open G apps 64 and then the problem was solved I contacted the developer and he has said that as the ROM is currently in you know pre beta phase like alpha phase so there are a lot of issues with the ROM and the ROM is very very buggy I don't recommend you to download it or install it again so just do just see the procedure but don't install it I recommend you not to install it but if you really want then the links will be in the description below make sure you check that so guys uh, well it's coming I believe well the Android welcome screen has arrived and you can see whenever I'm tapping there are some you know red you know the red borders around the screen touch is not that much responsive guys I'm not you know okay it works at least and I will be skipping all the things you know you can see that whenever I'm tapping on the display there are kind of you know red border around the screen and that's another bug yes that's no firework happening in there that's a bug of the rom and yes it's gonna take a lot of time for developers to handle all these issues to you know remove all these bugs and give us a more stable rom but development is all about these things and i have contacted the developer and he has said that he will be posting a lot of updates in the upcoming future if that arrives i will definitely be doing a separate video on that but as of now don't just don't install the rom see the procedure if you like but i would recommend you not to go for this rom but if you want to use a different kind of rom that based on aosp you can easily go for it so yes you can see there are you know some fireworks in there well google play services is not working but it, it will work after you flash the open g apps 64 arm 64 version again so this is pretty good and the whole thing is in chinese that i don't understand so sorry for that this is all for today guys like this video if you want dislike if you want do subscribe to our channel for more and there are other videos will be in the cards make sure you subscribe to our channel till then bye people have a great great day hope to see you in my next video